What's up, dudes, and welcome back to Headhunter Gaming. My name is Calvin, and today we got some Division 4 gameplay. But this is giving me a new format. We're going to do it just like a recap show. From here on out, it's going to be smooth sailing. I don't really want to talk about anything today, so I figured do a recap from now on. Anyways, the San Jose Reds lose travel to Philadelphia to take on the A team. Christopher Stieg. Faces off against Eric Lindros here, the opening face off. Wins it back to Dan over to Yandel. DDD pass. And just waiting over to Kane, who decides to skate in wide. Great deke to the outside. Passes it to Steen, shoots over the net. First Steen gets the puck, gets nailed over to Steen. And Steen with a beautiful cross crease pass just puts it over to Kane. And it is 1 0 red versus blue. 30. You know, 45 seconds into the game but in game time it's a minute and 58 yeah, minute 58 seconds left into the game so now they take some one nothing lead in the goal by Patrick Kane assisted by Alexander Stieg and Chris first fast forward a little bit now approaching the halfway mark and Marlow sh shoots and hits the goalie Third chance and a great save by Lynn back. Man, he is, was awesome in this game. And there's a penalty. Four check, deeks wide, passes it over to. I don't really say. And it's the end of the first period. Second period now here in the game. Versteeg shoots it and is saved by Mason. Great opportunity by Versteeg. And they cough it up and we go offside. So they decided to head down. Right now, Lindros. That dude is big. Lindros gets great opportunity. Anyways, fast forward here. Johnson with the point shot. Ends up being tipped wide, but Patrick Kane, again, another cross crease pass. He shoots and he scores. Red versus blue takes a 2 0 lead halfway through the second period of this game. As you see, I lose a face off again. But cross crease passes in this game will goal, and right off the bat, Immediate response, they score one to take. It is now a two to one lead. Jamie Ben with the sniper from the from the hash marks, the dead zone in this game. And it is two to one. Fast forward now to, towards the end. Patrick Kane and seeing the scoring line is out there going DDD passes. Kane looking for his third goal of the game. Instead, Steen gets it and shoots. And somehow glitches out. Anyways, fast forward now to the third period. Still up two to one. Still looking for those cross creases, but ain't getting them. Now going back the other way, after a bad deflection, it is tied 2-2 two to two on a goal by Eric Lindros, who, oddly enough, assisted by Mike Madano, the Hall of Famer going to the Hall of Famer. Halfway through the third period, Kane, again, looking for his third goal, tries to go for the cross crease, and... A great save by Steve Mason. End of the third period. Now with one more chance for the A team and they don't get it off as time expires for the end of regulation. In the overtime period after blocking a pass, Dan Boyle tries to go over to Couture but an errant pass and he can't pick it up and Couture snipes it home and red versus blue ends up winning three to two. And the overtime goal by Logan Kircher. Here are the stats for the game, and I hope to see you all next time here on Headhunter Gaming.